All right, man. So what is up, guys? Everybody here, back in another video. And today I'm showing you guys the best Jimmy Butler build out of HK24. Uh, so this build is gonna be kind of like a lockdown type of build. You know what I'm saying? Defend like the one through four, one through five. Um, you shoot the ball, can dunk, uh, can handle the ball really well too. Uh, it's kind of like an all-around kind of ISO lockdown kind of build. Make sure you stay tuned. Make sure you comment, and subscribe. But uh, yeah, just get into the uh, video. So I'm just looking at the um, the stats of Jimmy Butler and his uh, his 2KU thing. Uh, so 80 driving dunk, uh, which is gonna be pretty solid. We're gonna have 79 mid range, 83 ball. So 83 ball is gonna be pretty nice, bro. I ain't gonna lie. 80, 83 ball, you're gonna be able to hit shots with that. I'm not gonna lie, you'll be able to hit shots with that. 85 free throw. We do get some post attributes as well. Post hook 80, post trade 80, post control to 80 as well. We're gonna have, I think, like a 75 on this build. So the post, like in terms of playing the post, really, really solid. Um, pass hacker, she's 85. Ball handling is 86. I'm, the playmaker is not gonna be this stacked. Like we're not gonna have a like a 85 pass tackle. So we're gonna have a 75 and then a 77 speed ball with an 86 ball handle. Um, but the like ne nevertheless the dribbling is still gonna be really good. Um, so yeah, ball handling 86 that's gonna be nice. We have the interior to 82, 94 perimeter, 90 steel, 65 block, uh, and then we get uh, rebounding at 59, 62 offensive rebounding, uh, 65 block. We're gonna have a, like a 77 on this build. Just get anchor on bronze. Uh, I feel like the you know the guard and bigs and stuff in the post anchor on bronze is definitely gonna help out. Um, so yeah, defensive rebound 59, lateral quickness is gonna be a um, 92, which that just ties into speed. Uh, then 84 speed, 84 acceleration, 76 strength. Uh, we're gonna have, I think like an 82 or something on this build, um, just to get that uh, movable enforcer and also bulldozer on bronze or silver something like that. Uh, then we're gonna get vertical at 82, which is solid. And then we get 97. We're gonna have a 99 stamina on this build. To get that hall of fame 94 feet uh and then the mess the rest of the stuff doesn't really matter so this is basically going to be like the um sort of like the blueprint of the build uh the defense isn't going to be this stack like we do get a 94 we're gonna have a 93 the steel is a little bit lower the interior is a little bit lower the pass accuracy is a little bit lower uh but like i said in past videos you can't make this exact player in the in the builder uh but yeah that's for a newer skin in the video all right man, so let's get into the build bro so i'm gonna go right with the uh, handness obviously it doesn't really matter uh, jersey number. I guess I'll go 22 because that's the jersey number right now. But obviously the jersey number is not gonna matter uh, towards like your gameplay and stuff. So we're gonna hit continue right here, and then we're gonna go small forward for the position. All right, small forward. We're gonna stay at six seven for the height. We're gonna go up to two thirty for the weight. The reason why I'm putting up two thirty is to get that extra strength, and also two thirty is his actual weight, and we'll be able to get like a bigger body type in general. So yeah, I mean I think two thirty is just good all around. And then wingspan, we're gonna go seven four just to get the best defense possible. We do. We still do. Oh my gosh, I can't talk. We still do get a 79 uh three ball on this build so yeah the shooting's gonna be good the defense obviously gonna be the same you know what i'm saying once we uh max that out uh seven four wingspan max wingspan we also be able to dunk handle the ball pretty well uh but yeah same of the attributes so starting off with the close shot we're gonna put that at a 50 all right we're gonna put it at a 50 uh then driving layup is going to be a 70 which will get us that bronze for this finisher once you're the strength rating uh the driving dunk we're putting that up to a 73 all right 73 driving dunk we'll get that bronze post rise once you're in the vertical uh now we're gonna put the post control up to a 75 as, as you guys saw in there he had a, a 75 post control or not 75 he had an 80 but we're gonna have 75 on this build to get that unpluckable uh we're gonna have it on silver actually we're gonna have unpluckable on silver um but yeah we get some pretty decent post badges you know what i'm saying once we upgrade the other stats uh yes uh the shooting mid is gonna be an 80 uh we're gonna have a 79 on the three ball and that's basically gonna be it for the shooting. I mean, the shooting's gonna be pretty good. You know what I'm saying? We do get corner specialist, green machine, space creator, claymore on silver, comeback kit on gold uh, with that, I think like 79, 80, 80 mid range. Uh, so yeah, the shooting is gonna be good. We got mini magician on silver, guard up, open looks. Um, and you'll be able to play in the post, like shoot post fades, cause you got that 75 post control and then you got that 80 mid range. Um, so you get that, can you get post fade phenom on this build? Yeah, you do get out on gold. So uh, yeah, gold post fade phenom. We'll be able to play in the post, and you also do have a strength rating. So, yeah, I mean, this build is going to be a decent, like, post-scoring type of build as well, if you really want to play that way. But, um, yeah, let's move on to the playmaking. Pass accuracy is going to be a 75. We get that dimer on silver. We get uh, break starter on silver. Then we get that uh, post playmaker, relay passer, special delivery. Yo, all you really need is a 75 in this game. I know some people are saying, like, you need a higher pass accuracy, but you're going to be a lock at the end of the day. So as long as you just have, like, a somewhat decent pass accuracy, that would be, like, like usable. It's going to be just fine, bro. 75 is decent. Uh, 86 on the ball handle. Uh, so 86 ball handle will get us some pretty good drill moves. Also get some uh, pretty good playmaking badges as well, like unpluckable. Um, and then the spewal ball, we're going to get it up to a 75. All right, 75 spewal ball. Um, 75 spewal ball is going to be pretty solid as well. We will get the hyperdrive speed booster, all that other stuff once we upgrade the, uh, like the speed and the acceleration. 
but in terms of the ball handling, it's going to be 86. The only reason why I got it at 86 is because the 2KU player had it at 86. So I'm trying to make it like as realistic as possible, but while still making it a usable build. Uh, so yeah, start off with the defense. Start, start off, let's uh, go to the defense. 61 in the interior. The only reason I'm going 61 just to get that anchor on bronze. Uh, 82, I mean, 82 is a little bit too high, I'm not going to lie, because, I mean, this is a 6-7 small forward at the end of the day, so you don't really need a 61, or you don't need an 82. Uh, perimeter, we're going to put that to a 93, alright, 93 perimeter, we'll get his gold clamps, uh, once we have the strength rate, and we get, uh, challenger, fast feet, pick dodger. The defense on this build is going to be absolutely elite. We also do get an 81 steel, which will get us that, uh, silver interceptor. We also do get bronze glove, rice stick rip rust, uh, bronze. So we get, we'll get um, some steals on this build. We also do got max wingspan, don't forget. So getting steals will be pretty easy. Like getting lanes, getting uh, like pickpocket steals. Uh, it's going to be pretty nice. But moving on to the block, we're going to put that up to a 77. All right, 70, or not 77, 78 actually. Because uh, 77 will give you a bronze anchor, but 78 will get you that chase on artist once you have the speed and the vertical and stuff like that. Um, so, I mean, yeah, 78 is going to be really, really nice on this build. Keep the rebounding at 48. And then the speed is going to be at 82. Uh, just got the hyperdrive, and then we got the acceleration max. Strength is going to be 84. Uh, so, yeah, 84 strength will get us that bulldozer on Hall of... Not Hall of Fame. Uh, on Silver, we get Fields Finisher, Bronze, Gold Clamps, obviously. Then we get that Physical Handles. Brick Wall on Silver. Uh, then we got Move on Forcer, Back Down Punisher. Uh, so, yeah, strength is going to be 84. That's going to be really nice. Uh, Vert is going to be a 74. The only reason why we're getting a 74 is just to get that Chasing Artist on Silver. As you guys can see, if I go any lower than 74, we can't get that chase on Artist. Uh, we don't need that high of a vertical just because, I mean, we do have a 73 driving dunk, so it's not really going to matter that much. Uh, but it still will matter, like, a little bit. And then the uh, stamina is going to put at a 99, which gets us Hall of Fame, uh, 94 feet. And I think I was missing something here, actually. Uh, 78, I got an 84, 74. So I think I'm missing something here. I don't I don't really know um, what I'm missing. Oh, I think the standing dunk was a 30 on the, on the original. Oh, no, no, uh, 77 speed ball. That's what we need. 77. And that's going to be the build, bro. So, 77 speed ball will get us that uh, triple strike on gold. Uh, so, triple strike is actually a pretty good badge this year. Simply just because you can, like, do uh, jab steps. And it'll, like, um, basically increase your speed, like, off the dribble after you do that jab step. Um, so, yeah, it's going to be really, really solid. We get some really good badges on this build. Obviously, insane defense. Um, but, yeah, so let's move on to the, uh, to the name of the build. It is going to be Shades of uh, Bruce Bowen, Andrew Wiggins, and the man himself, Jimmy Butler, bro. Emo Jimmy Butler. You know what I'm saying? We got the. They don't have it in the game yet, but we, they're gonna have it in the game at some point. Two way perimeter threat. This is an insane build, bro. Um, but I mean, yeah, it's gonna be it for the video. If you guys like it, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I do post every day on this channel, so make sure you stay tuned for uh, basically daily uploads. I got builds, gameplay, stuff like that. Um, but I mean, yeah. Anyway, this is Airball. Peace.